so, um, <laughs> I was gonna go back and, uh, make it back in today, then start the episode, and I feel bad for not recording it now, but, um, uh, the reason why this game is paused is because, um, this thing started chasing me, but it jumped over that bridge, and now it's flying. What do you think about this, Majora? Oh, well, I'm gonna come back to daylight, so, yeah. Okay, well, now that that mess is done. <laughs> Hello, everyone, 06Tan12 here, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we put the ruby tablet thing into the thing, and the thing, children. And in this episode, I think we're gonna go down to the surface. I think I'm done with side quests for now. I think I'm just gonna have a bunch of videos dedicated to side quests, but not now. We got stuff to do. <gasps> oh, Link Cuckoo is Cuckoo is, sa is safely back at home, and it's all because of you. I don't know how to express my gratitude. Cough up some gratitude crystal things. That's what they're called. They resem they also resemble um. So I let the fanfare play because my voice always seems to get drowned out by it. Uh, they resemble star bits from Super Mario Galaxy, and I believe they resemble some type of Japanese candy. I'm not, I mean, I think it's Japanese, and I'm also not 100% sure of what the name is, but that's what it is. Okay, it must have taken a lot of gratitude to, gratitude to produce this bunch of five crystals. Helping people feels good. Hicks, yeah. Okay. If memory serve, which it usually doesn't... Where is my gear? Is this... Okay, yeah. If memory serves, there are, I think, 80 of these. 10 of them are scattered around uh, Skyloft Dad Knight individually. And the rest just come from side quests. So, yeah. Anyway, now that that's done... And... Hmm. How am I doing on potions, actually? Because I still have a fairy. I think I'm... Yeah, I'm good. Okay. So, I think, if anything, we're probably just gonna head down to the surface. I don't think Beetle has anything for s- Oh my gosh. I don't think Beetle has anything for sale that we'd want, so... Oh, mmm, so... Anyway, I wonder where she's gone. We could talk to this guy to start another, uh, Gratitude Crystal quest, but honestly, I just wanna get on with the story. I'll help you, like, ten more parts, maybe more, but I, I promise I'll help you. I'll help you. So, oh wait, the pillars! I've got the pillars over there. Oh well, we'll just go over here. Also, I gotta like talk loud in the sky because I don't know how to adjust audio yet. And like, the sky drowns out my voice. Hopefully, you can hear me now. No, I'm kidding. It's pretty quiet now. I'll talk now. So, anyway, all we have to do now is just head over to the pillar. That's pretty much it. Can you hit this? Oh my gosh, you can. I'm sorry, bird. Playing this game, I realized the birds don't have names, which is kind of sad. Like, that's sad that the fact that my bird has no name. Oh well. Anyway, head down here. And... The lava. That's it. Lava. Freaking lava everywhere. Master, this is El Volcano. It is an active volcano rich with the power of the earth. The music's here kind of cool too. Not as cool as like Death Mountain from Twilight Princess. Well, whatever. Or Go on City from Ocarina Time. Magical. That song. Anyway, approximately 65% of the region is covered in lava. It is inhabited by large amount of creatures that fight the extreme heat and dark flame. I read it all. Oh my gosh. Alright, with final materials such as wood and fabric. The reason why I read it all so fast is because I didn't think I had time to read it. Cause, yeah. All right, I highly recommend that you extinguish the flames by performing a forward roll or a spin attack. So our clothes can catch fire, and she also said wood. That's why I switched over to the iron shield. So yeah. 
Mm -hmm. This area is also ginormous. So yeah. Bye bye. Okay. I also like the little maple. Sorry, that was weird. I don't know why I was turning around like that. But I also like the little maple trees just at the beginning. Actually, yeah, there's a couple more. Okay. I was gonna say, I'm not gonna save yet. These things, these are things too, but I think they can burn me? I'm not sure. Also, yes, I'm well aware that we got it. Yes. Okay. It still will say that every time you turn on and off the game. Like, every, like even if you have like 45 of those, it'll still tell you what they are. Anyway, over here is another goddess cube, so I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Okay. Oh, oh gosh, I'm sorry, that was weird. Anyway, Ping! Fight, what do you want? I don't know how to do Please. Alright, please. Okay. Uh, no. Okay, okay we're done. Um, I think there's... No, there's not. Okay, I thought there was another cube over there, but I guess not. Uh, I guess I was just thinking of the one. Okay. Let's jump back. Actually... Yeah, yeah, I don't remember this area quite that much. Like, not as much as Fair on Woods, but seriously, man. Okay, head over here. Oh, I remember this. Just this part. These things are kind of cool too. Not as cool as Geekly's, but you know. Hey, hey, hey! Y you mess with our turf and you're gonna pay? Aww. Whoa, you're not. Yo, Red, I don't think this is one of those red creeps. Y y yeah, I think you're right. No reason to scare the hair off us, though. Sorry about that, pal. These monsters showing up and messing with our turf has got me on edge. I can't do a gangster voice to save my life. They showed up here and I'm gonna knock the red clean on them. Yeah, that's what I'm doing here. Yeah, yeah, me, Red. <laughs> Yeah, whatever, I'm just too scared to do my work. Anyway, if you're looking for treasure, you should take clear of those red guys. Anyway, these things, I think they are called Lead. He's a member, Moga, of a mole race called Moga. Basically, yeah, they all just kind of love treasure. And all of them are actually named off of, mate about, of uh, material, like, different... I don't know, know how to say. He's based off the word lead, L-E-A-D, and this guy, I don't remember his name, Cobble, so I think it's Cobble or something like that. Also, the faces that they're giving me is freaking horrifying. Look, mm. No, we're, we're getting out of this conversation. Pricers. Oh, uh, that was, mm. Oh, uh, is there something down there? Is there anything down there? Okay. Why? Oh, never mind. I thought there would be like a chest down here, but I don't know. Okay, that makes sense. Anyway, no. These are just annoying, man. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see if I remember what to do. I think there is something over there. Let's see if I can run. Oh, oh, oh. This is Look how scary it is. Can I make it? Yes, I can. Okay. He's gotta have something. That's it. Just six. What? Why make. Okay. Do what you gotta do. No, no, no. Oh, okay. So yeah, basically, if you touch lava, it's not instant death, but it'll just respond you to this area. Or the area you were last stabbed before you jumped. Man, I do not remember this place well. Is this gonna turn into one of those, I played the first 20 minutes of this game, but I don't remember the rest of that place? It is for me, isn't it? Because I don't I do remember the beginning of this game, and I do remember what happens, like, story-wise. Or, like, the areas in this game, and stuff like that. I just, I don't remember. Anyway, here's another one of these guys. Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Never seen you around here. Oh, well, hold up there. Are you a friend of those red creeps? No, I'm Link. I'm not, huh? Well, you don't look like them, that's for sure. You're not that ugly. You wanna go, sir? Uh, here to be palm flowers? I'm pretty sure he'll tell us whatever's each other way. Bonfires, you're joking, right? There are those things grow growing right over there. You pick one with A and you fuse the lights. Fuse sec okay, so basically, they're just like responding bombs. Toss them and roll them. Just like you do with George. Uh, you don't know? Yes, I do. If you tell me. Oh, he told me. And everyone knows that. Uh, what's your name? Quartz. So yeah, quartz. 
as in had a lot of stuff. Anyway, the bunch of stuff we can blow up, so this is stuff mostly to practice on, so let's see if I can do it. Just throw this one up there, do that. Blow that up. I'm pretty sure these all have like money or something behind them. I know one of these has a huge, like a giant chuchelli in it, and I think it's this one, so I'm gonna get ready for that. I think. I don't even remember. Ooh, yeah, mm, no. Okay, I think that's as big as it is. Actually. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so they can't break. I'm not sure where I got that. It is done. Oh, wait. Boop. Okay. You never know when you need treasures like that, so, you know, it's good to pick up all of them. Wait, we can roll that. Rolling's kind of hard in this game, and it's required in some parts, so, yeah. Way in here is the blue ruby. Okay. Turn around. Turn around. I've mm, I've only heard like the chorus of that. I've never heard the whole thing. Which is way in here. Actually, in here because I'm gonna get sidetracked forever. All right, that's where we're supposed to go. Um, on here. Oh yeah, there are ladybugs. Huh? So we can actually catch them. Eh. There we go. Got two volcanic ladybugs. They say that these bugs get their deep red hue from the ore they eat. They are slowly moving and tend to stay in one place. I'm pretty sh Oh man, I loved ladybugs as a kid. I'm pretty sure everyone, well not everyone, but a good majority of kids liked ladybugs as a kid. And you know, they're just cute. Like, they're the one bug I can actually stand. Like, mm, no, I can't, I can't stand anything. <laughs> No. Okay, they have actually do half of what's hard of damage. Okay. And we were out here, get a little op more open view of the place. Um, yeah, this area is long. I don't know if I want to keep going. Plus, it's like weight and stuff. Mm, that was weird. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice just felt weird. Okay, whatever. No one cares. Anyway, next time on the Legend of... Because I'm calling off here, because I'm... Oh my gosh, that's scary. I can't end this episode to save my life. Oh my gosh. Next time... Ooh, another heart piece. I get so easily distracted. Next time on the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, we're, being, we're going to be exploring even more of this place. This place is pretty big. We think we go through this part up there, up there, it's there. Then we gotta backtrack a bunch, which is kind of stupid. But oh well, we'll be doing that next episode. Uh, my braces hurt. Stuff happens. All right, see you then.